what should be the takeaway folks who attend the conference whether it's in person or virtual uh, how they can use this information that they gather at this conference so i'm a big believer in action so anything that i'm reading anything that i'm studying that doesn't lead with my ability to make a decision or take an action is ultimately something that that's not a good investment in my time so as you think through this you know, go look for research from vendors or from institutions that make recommendation on best practices. Um, go right now and look through all your vendors and say, did they? Did any of the vendors I use, the, let's say the top five vendors I spend money with, did they release research? There might be some best practices in there. Did they release new features? Because again, this is a big time of the year to release new features. And have I optimized those new features to make sure I'm getting the most out of my tools? Um, think about this research and, and, you know, use it as a training aid. Um, you know, new threats or new threat models. Um, you know, are we going to use them in our red teams? Um, understanding the changes in DDoS attacks or API attacks or large language model attacks allows me to war game and make sure my security is there. And finally, think about picking four or five talks from this and pushing it out to your team is free training. You know, we, we always think about training being, you know, costing us something. But here's an opportunity to, you know, just have our team go out, get some of this content that RSA puts out, be it through the webinars or the conference, bring it in, have a discussion with the team around it, and take advantage of some of that free training.